As they return to Washington from their August recess, gun control has lawmakers' attention. That will be our focus. Then we're going to have a hearing about assault weapons generally, about the AR-15s, which have been the weapon of choice in massacres. Maryland Democratic Congressman Jamie Raskin, a member of the House Judiciary Committee, says the committee is planning to meet this week and take up multiple bills addressing red flag laws, a ban on assault weapons and high capacity magazines, as well as how to disarm people convicted of hate crimes. There's not going to be one solution that's a panacea. Raskin says even these actions won't be enough unless Congress finds ways to limit access to guns. I mean, most uh, advanced societies uh, are far more restrictive in terms of giving people access to firearms, and that's the critical difference. But even if those measures were to pass in the House, it's unclear what President Trump and Senate Majority Leader Mitch McConnell will support. We're looking at some things that are very strong, and we have to do it in a bipartisan uh, way. And the president recently told reporters that his administration is working alongside Congress for a fix. I can tell you a lot of people are working on different scenarios, and we're going to see how it all comes about. But so far, the president isn't clear on what specific changes he supports. In Washington, Morgan Wright.